Here is something that could be extremely useful for anyone who is trying to figure out the height of a landing where both the top and the bottom of the stairway are going to have the same amount of steps. And that will be to simply divide the overall height or the total rise of the stairway or the distance between the top of the lower level and the top of the upper level and simply divide that number by two. For example, here we have four foot eight and then we divide this in half and it's going to give us two foot four inches. And hopefully that made sense, but if it didn't, let's go ahead and try it in inches. And we're going to add one more step to both the upper and the lower sections of the stairway. So for example, here we have 70 inches and half of 70 inches is going to be 35 inches. And even though this is basic math, I understand that some of you might not understand how to do this. So let's go ahead and walk you through what it would look like on the calculator. 70 inches and we're simply going to divide 70 inches by 2 and that's going to give us 35 or half of the distance and hopefully that made sense let's go ahead and take a look at the individual riser height of 7 inches for this stairway each one of the risers 7 inches and of course if we multiply 7 by the amount of risers 1 2 3 4 5 we're going to get 35 inches and since I'm not interested in creating a more complicated process than this. I'm going to go ahead and make this one of the shortest videos I've made in a long time. So let's go ahead and wrap things up by showing you the bottom section of the stairway so that you can see that both the top and the bottom have the same amount of steps. Otherwise this easy and simple method won't work.